Good afternoon, guys. Trevor Thompson, TNT Pressure Cleaning. Dynamite service with explosive results. What you're looking at is an asphalt shingle roof that still has soap on it, and uh, we have completed that side. You can see what it sort of looks like and what it's going to look like afterwards. Um, you can also take a look at the ridge cap here. I'll show you uh, sort of what it looked like uh, before. So there you go. And, uh, and how it's cleaning up. Um, we've also uh, you know, begun to start some areas. So I just wanna show you, now I am left-handed, the uh, phone is in my right hand, but I just kinda of wanted to show you, uh, we're gonna go ahead and get this pump uh, uh, primed up and you can sort of see kinda of what you're looking at here. And uh, what I'll do is I'll shift hands really quickly so I can lay out a section for you. All right. And, um, and just kind of show you sort of what this looks like. Now I've got a little kink in the hose, but you can kind of see what we're, uh, what we're doing here, how we're kind of laying it out. And, um, you know, this little four gallon a minute bleach pump, once again, we're, we just filled up with solution. So we're getting uh, a new prime on here. Um, but you can see how we're not over applying it. We're just laying it on and you have to sort of follow along. Uh, you don't want it too heavy, but you can clearly see that if I were to shoot over here, you can see here, now I can reach all the way down towards the end and I can lay that out all the way down there, just like that. So you want it so that it gets on the shingle, but not so that it's running. And you'll see a dramatic you know, difference there. These I go over gently, but as you can see, I bring a hose up with me. See on the end of that ladder, you can see a Dixon sprayer uh, with 100 feet of Flexilla down there. And so those will get sprayed off right away. Uh, we, don't we don't wait very long on those. You can just see the difference. You know what I mean? Just, you know, just eating up all that organic matter. You see all that black that's on there and you see what the color is now. So we're really changing that. This is the section that we just did. And you can already see it sort of changing. So um, just kind of wanted to let you guys see that. It really doesn't matter, um, you know, how you lay your solution. If you want to lay it from bottom to top, that's great. If you want to go from top to bottom, the only difference is you're going to have run, okay? And you want to prevent run. So, um, you know, it's going to be sort of how you decide to lay this out. I don't believe that there's a right or a wrong way um, because you can make the best out of every situation bottom to top is always best you know uh when laying chemical and then you're going to rinse top to bottom that's sort of what we teach and that's kind of what we uh that's uh, the standard um, and that's to prevent that running um that you can see over here so where we shot the top and see how it runs like that okay you don't want that to set on there for too long because you don't want discoloration um so you need everything to be nice and even um so we'll lay a small little little helper section there just to sort of help that out blend a little bit while we're talking and then uh and then we'll get we'll get back to work so just wanted to show you guys kind of you know the uh the four gallon a minute bleach pump in action once again you know all the way down by the ladder here you are here's the trigger there's a the little mini j rod there's the machine down there and uh you know we got about a 12 mile an hour wind we're shooting into the wind we're covering all the way down towards that ladder so you can see what that looks like all right guys back to work enough of the video stuff hope everyone's having a great